McLeod. I'm Roland Tana. And welcome to the 905 Roundup, uh, which this isn't uh, this isn't going to be a, a normal episode, ladies and gentlemen. We're, we're more, this is more of an announcement of changes uh, or, or to keep you in the in the loop, faithful listeners. Uh, but Roland and I have been having this conversation for a, a little while now, and it's uh, uh, it's time that we we kind of I guess looped you all into uh, what we've decided. Um, so we're we are going to be changing structure of uh, of the 905er uh, roundup uh, going forward. Uh, basically, we're going to roll this back to ideally once a month, uh, maybe maybe twice a month, depending on the story. But uh, this this part of the of the podcast is becoming a bit too much for just the two of us to uh, to kind of keep up with and, and to make sure that it's it's the quality that we want it to be. Uh, it, it's been, Roland and I have been kind of struggling to keep our passion for this part of the podcast going. Uh, we've been struggling with kind of making sure that it's relevant uh, and to kind of get away from just the the nitpicky kind of he said, she said mundaneness of the 905 uh, uh, <laughs> region, which, which is kind of our best way of saying it. Like, you know, this, that, this part of the podcast is all be you know be kind of behind the scenes has always been a bit of a was always a fluke like we we never planned for this part of the podcast to uh, exist uh, it just kind of happened it grew out of we well, initially in the first couple of episodes if you go way back in our catalogs we we, we sort of we would do an interview and then we would do a little bit of a discussion of the interview after the interview and we, we realized that that was uh, maybe not the fairest to the people being interviewed necessarily mm -hmm. depends on the depended on the subject but you know um and so it sort of grew up into we'd have another episode where we talk about stories in the news and the interview that we did early in the week and that grew into the the roundup but um yeah i think with the thing we neither of us want to be is like a couple of couple of white guys shaking their fists at the world and, and moaning now, every now week. Roland, um, the one thing that the world needs is more white guys yelling at us. <laughs> <just, laughs> cool. Yeah, yeah. Um, so, yeah, we, we don't want to do that. We don't think that's what you want to be listening to. It's not what we want to be. We, it's not what we want the 905 to be about. We want it to be about uh, investigating stories in the kind of depth that maybe they don't get elsewhere um, uh, with people you don't necessarily hear elsewhere um and highlighting some of the best things about the 905 things you maybe didn't know uh, about mm -hmm. the region um we, we tend to live in our own municipalities our own communities and not look uh, at what's happening in the communities next door and that was very much about you know point of the 905 it was like hey we share so much that um you know the, many of the problems and challenges we face you know we think that it's a Hamilton problem or a Burlington problem or a Mississauga problem. And it's like, it's not. We're all <laughs> dealing with exactly the same thing. So uh, focusing on those kind of things in, in more detail, uh, spending our, our you know, this this is a lot of work <laughs> doing this podcast. Yes. Um, and, you know, it's, uh, it's, it's a labor of love and we want to love it and not um, sort of be stretched so thin that we... Um, that we that when we don't feel that we're producing um the kind of quality and the kind of subject discussion that 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 we want to be discussing yeah i mean we always thought that the the this works best if we're taking that kind of fifty thousand foot uh, uh view of the problems because we've we've i think you and i've discovered over the last few i say dare say a few months uh, we've been kind of focusing on the mundane that the the, the not necessarily the mundane, but the just the the trivialities of municipal council life, and just getting into honestly becoming kind of what we thought local journalism had become, which was just oh, this councilor said this at that at this council meeting, and that was the that that was bad, or this matter happened, and we always felt that this would work a lot better if we were able to kind of show the interconnectedness of the various yeah. topics um so it, that, that being said we don't we still think there's a, a point for this uh, this part of the podcast there's a point to the 905 roundup 
but we thought we'd be able to kind of maybe focus a little bit more on that that banter and that that discussion between the two of us if we're, if we're able to take, kind of take time and actually and work on it now that being said we are going to still focus on every tuesday bring a, an episode where we talk with somebody who is far smarter far more smarter than roland or myself on a various topic uh so that you have a, a better understanding of on the on the issues that be but um kind that's of kind really of the, the most that's really where that's our where our passion, passion lies, is, is that, yeah. that tuesday episode with with, with uh with, a, with an in-depth interview or some kind of um detailed explanation of, of something hopefully that you're not going to hear anywhere else um or 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 here you know in a level of detail that you won't hear anywhere else you know um thinking back to episodes we've done uh where certainly there were stories that were in the news generally but you weren't going to hear thinking of the the interview we did with the uh the chair of the of the halton police services board um when um uh, there was a story about the chief of police uh going on vacation during during covid you know it was a big story but no one else was interviewing the people involved for half an hour um right uh, that kind of thing is where we can really uh, um, show our strength and also getting, you know, we've never just been about politics uh, and, and that kind of thing is you know, doing well, that, uh, the cultural scene, arts, music. Um, well, uh, I think that's the thing. We know from our, our, the data from our episodes, we know people like to think, oh, it's all politics and, and scandal. And some of the, our, I think you and I, our favorite episodes were episodes where we, it wasn't necessarily about politics, but it, it was about episodes uh, with author, authors and artists and people in the music scene or people, um, I, I, I'll, I'll be honest, one of our, one of our favorites was talking with Jason Cassis uh, during when COVID was happening about the effects of COVID on, uh, on, on the restaurant industry and just kind of an eye-opening take on that on that part of the economy and that part of the 905 and so when we're doing the 905 roundup it our focus and our efforts tend to be taken away from kind of finding those people or those stories that we think need to have more 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 of a spotlight on them that again traditional media just does not cover at the local scene that they just do not talk about these people outside of a maybe a the quick blurb of them donating something to a soup kitchen which is all well and good but i i i'd rather talk to them talk to the owners a lot more about their passion and, and their drive for whatever it is that they do so yeah we're, we're hoping that this this plan of action is going to help uh uh, uh drive drive better engagement that being said, uh, we are uh, we're also retooling our fundraising solutions. Um, I know for a number of time we've had Patreon and we've had Buy Me a Coffee on our website. That is still there, but we have added on a third option, which is a direct support directly to us. It's not going through a third party; it's going directly into us. Uh, you can find it on our website. Uh, look for the uh, be a supporter tag on our website. Uh, 905er.ca please click donate uh what you can ideally five bucks a month helps out we also have options for monthly even yearly contributions so you can click and donate for a year uh, i shouldn't say donate because it's not tax free but support us for a year and one-time payment and it goes directly into our coffers and helps us uh produce better quality content and just and just keep uh cover our expenses on the, on this podcast so i i would you're going to see more of that hopefully in the, in our episodes just helping to encourage you to to support us that way uh as well as to sign up for our, our weekly newsletter which we uh encourage you to do so yeah and just just to explain why while we're moving uh for those people who still support us through through patreon um we're not taking that away um but um uh <laughs> patreon takes a crazy amount a crazy percentage <laughs> of the money um uh so uh and for a for a service that um frankly i'm not that much of a fan of um so we can do all that ourselves um and it means that the support that you give us is actually supporting us and not some uh american multinational <laughs> uh well, that has a really crappy interface um so um 
yeah, we hope you like that. And 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 you know, if if uh, if some of our listeners, some more of our listeners, want to support us, it does make a big difference to um, our ability to to do those episodes, um, to do better episodes, to do newer things. Um, because yeah, it all takes money. Um, but uh, you know, it's not never going to be a compulsory thing or anything like that but but it, it really does help so we, we do encourage you to go check out our website at the nine fiverr.ca click on become a supporter and um um yeah four, four bucks a month or um whatever 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 works for you is uh, extremely gratefully uh, received and really uh, means the world to us yeah so that's that's it for us uh this week no no big baffle gab or, or back and forth we but we, we just want to let you uh le- you know about these changes that we've kind of come to uh for the podcast and we hope that you continue to listen continue to support us uh, financially as well as just by listening sharing liking uh retweeting reposting you know all the- and um yeah uh, anybody who's who's if you're through apple in particular give us a five-star review on apple um uh, that is probably the most uh uh, effective way to really uh, um, help us grow um, those, those Apple reviews uh, really have a massive effect so uh, say that you like us um, preferably um, <laughs> um, on the uh, on Apple reviews and you know if you give us a good review maybe we'll read it out on the podcast sometime or just email that email into us if you don't like us Absolutely. email us yeah, and, if you don't like us, email us. We read those and we reply to those. Uh, if you do <laughs> like us, share it on Apple, Apple, Apple podcast reviews. Yeah. Uh, but thanks very much, everyone. Uh, that's it for this week. We will be back on Tuesday. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.